enjoy my motherfucking life. That's all I'm saying. I A chance to come over to exclusive sounds, um, touch up my tweeters, I end up changing on my lowers, updating my lowers. I've had my lowers on my bike for over my old lowers over there for what six years, since seven years, seven years. So we decided to change them out today. <laughs> I ain't got COVID either. He said, What? I ain't got COVID. Hey man, I, we should have jumped on it as soon as he sneaked. <laughs> Why? You see that video when they did that? Oh boy, when, uh, when COVID was big, uh, oh boy went into the uh, bathroom. He was talking, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. And they go to the bathroom. Shoot, they jumped in the bathroom. <laughs> yeah, you tricking me now. Trying to figure this out. You could blame it on me. It's all my fault. But I gotta go now. Can't take it no more. It don't even matter. I ain't keeping us go. Gotta be all about me before I'm all about you. If I don't take care of me, I'm no good to you. I can't sacrifice my feelings no more. Gotta be careful who I have to let go. I'm changing things around this time. Well, I mean, before then, I'm gonna be riding. So you we ain't gonna have no car down there. Yeah, I got both the trucks coming, but Mike okay. is driving one, the Queen driving her Hardy. Okay. I'm on a bike. So you gonna be moving around the whole time on your motorcycle? No. I'm gonna be once I get there. I'm, I'm on my golf cart. We gonna do the update there. I'm not gonna wait a whole 30 days when I can do the update today, but that's. But so he's basically saying all radios, if you need your radio update, he's gonna be doing them up there. <laughs> That's what he's saying, y'all. So. <laughs> the mad side. What you working with? What you looking for? You ain't got it. I do. Trust me, you ain't got it. What you looking for? Just, just be cool. Apple your your playlist? No, I ain't looking for oh. a playlist. I cause I ain't put this on my playlist yet. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I ain't got it, you know what I'm saying? I ain't got it. Anyway, we out here, man, at Exclusive Sound. Actually, I have put it on Apple Music, but... We just, you know... Yeah, I can't see no more. <laughs> 24 hours, 24 hours, really ain't enough time. Ain't enough minutes, ain't enough minutes to tell you.
what is it that blows the tweeters out? Is it just over time or tweeters? Over time. Yeah. Over time. Because the, this, this tweeter is just a diaphragm that the, and then the frequency is being off. Right. Yeah. So what I did is that when when Rudy shout out to Rudy, Worldwide Entertainment, yeah. he uh, left it as a two channel, but then I just set it up as a four channel. Okay. So now we can do better adjustments and everything. Mm -hmm. So that's all. We done with him too. Just put his bag in. Yeah. So what but up yeah. with it? Yeah. Yeah. How you doing? I'm good, Chief. So hey man, CL is recording. Is, is this live video? Uh huh. Okay. I got one of my coworkers. He wanted to get a bike sold from Mary, you know, from Fairbanks to Marietta. I think to the BMW dealership. I don't know nobody else to refer him to, so I would refer him to you. He said one guy's trying to charge him five hundred dollars. I said I don't know what the going rate is right now. It wouldn't. It wouldn't be that. It would. It wouldn't be that. But right now I'm down for like two weeks. My bike. My truck is in the paint shop. Yes, sir. You got, you got a backup Did, have you tried Octane Torn? Who? Oh? Octane. O C T A N E. Octane Torn. Octane Torn? Yeah, try him uh, out. Try him out. Okay, appreciate it. All right. All right. All right. And see, look. Cell can't get to it. Just give it to somebody else. Man, I, man listen, man. It's customer talking, service. I'm doing boutique toy, man. He said a BMW. That don't even qualify. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just keeping it 100, man. You know what I'm saying? BMW on the back of this? Oh, no. <laughs> oh. The what? Hey, man. So, yeah, man, let's talk about the, 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 the bike fest jamboree. Oh, hold on. Let me start a fresh new one. Let's keep it PG. All right, man, I'm up what, at the exclusive sale, is man. This is my new eye. This is bad. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Is that the one that follow you around? No, no, that's my other one. That's in there. What then, man? Let me get the old. Let me get one of your old cameras. I just sold my GoPro. I gave my GoPro away. To the GoPro 9, I gave it everything, all the mod adjustment, microphones, lights, all that for $400. I was on Facebook Live. to do when I, As soon as I said the price. As soon yeah. as I did the price. All right, I did all right, so Chris, you being the exclusive sound provider installer for the Jamboree, yeah. what do you have to offer? What are we offering? We're doing, here's, what, here's the deal, right? Are you doing complete systems? Houses? We're doing complete setup. Repairs? We're doing repairs, pull ups, everything. But if you come up with that Fugazi, we gonna send your ass back up north. <laughs> you heard it, Fugazi. We ain't doing it because we, we ain't got time. So would it be would it be better for somebody to make an appointment now? Yes, yeah, so we January? only have two appointments left because okay. we only there three days. For Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Three days and all of two. We all we we got three left. Three appointments. Three yeah. slots. Three slots left. But then because we have to, what what every every experience when we go out is a learning experience. Uh, this year in Daytona, man, we had a ton of walk-ups. Yeah. People with issues and everything. And then we're going to try to accommodate everybody. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We're not, if we can, or we're going to try to point you in the right direction so that you can get fixed, taken care of. Most audio issues, if it's none of that crazy shit, we could, I mean, I'm sorry. If it ain't none of that crazy stuff, we can take care of. It. Yeah. So what we did was that we just allotted two appointments and walk-ups. Okay. So it's some guys from Arkansas. Uh, actually, we, we do a pool bills. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So we're gonna have enough equipment. I'm bringing uh, four cases of eights, four cases of six by nine, eight cases of six and a half. So are eight standards now? Is that standard now, or is it six by nine still the king? It's all who you it depends. Because yeah. all us. 10 years, 10 plus years in the game, I won't care nothing about that. Yeah. We're just trying to ride. Yeah. Uh, but the new guys, which is no knock to the new guys, they want eight, 10, stuff like that. I won't do 10s out there because the 10s is too cumbersome and then you have to do a, a port in the bottom of the bag to get all that work. And then that's just, huh? No, you can just do it. 
See, I'm, I'm used to cars. You gotta have airspace to get the space on you don't have to have none of that no more. Because they don't really, they bikes not. Well, they make speakers with no they space. Make, they make no space speakers, basically. No, yeah. yeah. They make them. I got flat speakers in my truck. They 12 inch. They sit on the seat. They're flat. They 12 inch woofers. They zero air space. My whole back seat is basically a box. Yeah. That's so how they do the bags. I'm saying these bags don't got so much. So with technology and the way things go now, everything yeah. changed. So when that changed like that, I mean. You either accommodate it. Now, trust me, me me and this guy right here, boy, we went down with a fight because I didn't want to do it. Yeah. But, you know, you got the... I had super glue. I had a uh, Gorilla glue that on there, so I don't know if it's going to stick. I do. I got some more. Some people, people, I believe that. Better. I believe that. You know what I'm saying? I like the eights better because the, the eights, eights... Over tens? Yeah. But, but hear me out now. The eights... This is what the eight do. That explains it best. Anybody follow boxing, right? If you follow boxing, an overhead swing is an overhead swing is an overhead swing. But if you would do, would you rather take one overhead swing or a bunch of jabs? Eights jab. The tens overhead. They, they're, they, they're, it, it travels more. So... But it depends on what base you're looking for, because I mean the ten is a deeper base than the eight, ain't it? Hey man, the eight, eight is a pun- eight is a punchier a base. Box, yeah, eight's punch. Eight is a punch. It's jab. Punch. Yeah, that's what it is. They jab. Yeah. Where the ten swings. But the eight is the, is the same base as a six by nine, ain't it? Or is the six by eight got a little bit more punch? They got more punch. They got more punch on eight, especially when you're doing it the right way. And again, let me do this this shameless plug to all of these fellow, you know, fellow biker audio guys that's out here doing it. Much respect to y'all that's doing them tens and stuff. I love to hear them. I think that they're incredible when I hear them. But in our setup that we do, we we built to do it, but that don't fit our format. Yeah. So I'll refer them to... Your dad said some, some genius shit years ago. <laughs> hey, tell Chris, quit talking about these other shops. They, they give you no checks at all to promote them. <laughs> but there's a lot of shops in Atlanta that's doing yeah. it. So if you want the 10, there's a lot of people out here that's doing it. And, but if you want something where you can pull up on us and we get you in and get you out, we still, we still 24 hours. Yeah. I don't give a shit what it is. Yeah. And then when we get in rally mode, we three in 24 hours. So, and then, you know, to see it, you have to see it because people really don't believe that we do a bike. You pull in, drop it off, we'll see you in two and a half hours. Done. Done. If it's six by nines, oh man, come on, bro. You yeah. come pick that motherfucker up. <laughs> the, the, the woofers, are they just like those woofers? They just the woofer or are they coming with the tweeters and the. No, yeah, that's, a, that's a more of a mid range setup. He's talking about like. A you know, horn, the Neo, the horn, yeah. that got the horn in the middle of it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, they, now. So it's more of a speaker than just a woofer. No, they're mid-bass. Mid-bass. Or they do make subwoofer. Well, I'm, I'm going to bring this guy up because he did some work on your bike. So I, I feel that that's fair to do that. Rudy. Rudy putting a 12 in bikes right now. Yeah. Shout out to that nigga. Must be some extended bags for that. No, <laughs> they stock bags. I don't see how you can do that. A 12-inch woofer in that bag? They shallow. They are shallow mount. Rudy, I ain't gonna put your business out in the street. I know this ain't live though, right? This, no, no, this record. Record. So you can do some editing and stuff. Well, so I, I ain't gonna put his business. I ain't gonna put his business out. No, I put, well, when we pause it, when we we hang it up, mm-hmm. I mean. Because I seen it, and I was like, you got a 12, and I heard it. Incredible. Yeah. Incredible. But here's the deal with that. I want him to take that show on the road and do it on the road. So that's just basically a show bike for competition. No, when I say take it on the road, be able to do it on site. Go build it on the road like you do. Do it on site. People can't do that. I mean, people can. I and we had we're not doing nothing that nobody else can do if they just apply themselves to it to do it. But you gotta want to do it. We built this brand on a fast response, excellent customer service, 
granted, I fall off sometimes because shit, I, I miss, the, miss the phone calls or we just be busy. Right now, we winding down because we finna out of town. Normally, we yeah. stack. He got, he got to ride that motorcycle over there. Yeah, I got to ride. <laughs> I ain't happy about that. But, I mean, it is what it is. But, hey, listen, though. I am. Hey, I ain't too happy about that. Hey, man. No, nah, I'm with it, though. I joined the club that ride motorcycles, and we're going to ride our motorcycles. Hey, man. Yeah. So, but you going to be ready when they get down there. Be ready where? Get down to Tampa, oh yeah, back. we coming, boy. So we coming down there to set up first. Then come back and get your bike. Like no, no, he going, going on. No, I'm talking. That man about got boat trade. Got all kind of everything. I don't even. Are you even taking your bike? He, he going to ride his bike. We driving. He not bike. taking his bike. Hey man, we take an e bike. Yeah, you didn't see me on the yeah, e bike. I, I, no, I got hey, that. That's what we riding there around. Yeah, around. yeah. He I'm went and bought one and took his bike. Listen, I went to get one. I was getting up me and Queen one for Christmas. Uh, up at the tower. Like, and then another valuable lesson that we learned. Daddy said it best. Quit giving your bikes a ride to Daytona just to set up. Yeah. We don't ride them when we get there. So yeah, he here's what me and Daddy did this year. Hey, man, we're taking the light bike so we can just scoot around. <laughs> we did. We rode one time. <laughs> and that was that on... Was one, one time in 10 days. That was in 10, that was Saturday night or Sunday night. The first Saturday. The first Saturday night. night. We got to Daytona. That was the only time we rode bikes. The whole rest of the time he was working. I called, my, I called Octane. I said, yo, I don't care whatever you do, put the golf cart on the trailer and bring it with you. He put the golf cart on the trailer, sent it to me. The minute that he got there, I put I put my bike in. Daddy put his bike in. He was on his way back to Atlanta. <laughs> and then we kept the golf cart. Well, this dude pulled up on us with an e-bike. My wife finna get on hers now. With an e-bike. And we, you know, we like, yeah, what is that? Daddy was like, oh, nigga, that's that e-bike. I'm like, e-bike? I'm telling you, we was getting them for Christmas. Yeah, I had got them for me. Yeah. So, yeah. And that was DJ Dirty Guy. Remember I told you? Electronic bikes. You no, yeah, kind of, sort of. But remember I told you that's why we were getting Queen for Christmas and she flipped out and didn't want it? Man, why you guys say, man, it's the hottest shit? That shit finna be hot. Right ah. now, they done made the news. Electric cars and electric Mercedes bikes. Mercedes make them now. Mercedes yeah. make them. Harley Tesla make them. one. Tesla. Oh, yeah. I know so, about the cars. I know about the bikes. No, yeah. so they like got when bikes. Down there in Tampa, when you see us they got it. Listen. They got the skateboards now. Yeah, with battery operated. Well, I be seeing all this stuff on the price right. That's far as I go with me. Yeah. I see him selling these electric bikes. So, so mean, what we ended up doing is that we we got home, we weighed everything out. That they was like, nigga, I'm getting mine today. I was like, <laughs> sign me up, I'm getting mine too. End up getting them. They, that's the only. Th- I don't care what bike rally. But they go to 35 miles an hour, 30 to 35 miles an hour. I will like never, that. I'll yeah. never take a bike back to Daytona. Never. It'll be the golf cart. And the e-bikes. And then the cold part about the bikes we got, they fold in half. Put it in the trunk of the car. You can put well, it in the trunk. Of Daytona, you can't really ride the motorcycle anyway, it's so crowded. No, nah, we, 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 you can ride. Oh, they have so many stop signs, it's like, uh, stop. No, nah, it, it ain't nothing like well, when you, you, you got. Bike, you can get on that yellow line and just shoot right on So when I rode, like, uh, and for over at Bethune where I'm at, right? So this was Friday mm-hmm. or Thursday. Dude, we doing this dude bike. He pulled back up. I said, hey, man, let me ride that bike. He's like, look, let me show you how to ride it first. Boy, when I first got on, like the brand some niggas over, so that wasn't ready for it. <laughs> but then the minute I caught on to it, in the middle of the street, I went. Police can't say nothing to you. I'm on a bicycle getting through traffic. You don't have a bike lane. So we get down to the bike, to the Tampa Bike Fest. Bike Jamboree, what's the official name? Uh, you know, it's the Tampa Jamboree. It's the Tampa Jamboree Bike Fest. Shouts out to this guy behind the camera. He pulled it off. Me and Daddy, Daddy was talking to him. He's like, nigga, they done, they done pulled this off. Now, of course, you're going to have the, the, the naysayers that don't believe that it's going to still go to Myrtle Beach and take their money down there, and they don't want your money down there. But here it is. You got a whole city that's embracing it. The whole city. Saying, bring all your, bring your money here. Ride your motorcycles, hang out, go to the beach, do all What's of this. Lady? We welcome you here. What's going on? I'm going there. Yeah, now I'm down for two weeks. Shit. Hands down, bro. That nigga, they pulled something off that. I didn't think that. I, 
I was a doubter. I wasn't no hater. I just doubted because the efforts in to get people to do yeah. it. But this dude right, lead a movement every day. He lead a movement, so it's easy for him to pull it off. But the he average, was able to do it. the average Joe Smo wouldn't have been able to pull it off. And whatever he say, the his community, the followers of AFA show. take that as gospel because most of the time I've only heard him say one or two things that I just didn't agree with. That's just me. That's personal. But then that's that's the thing with being individuals. You're not going to agree with everything somebody says. But I know it's a lot of with, the, with this whole thing, man, hey, mean. look, if done right, the way that I know that they putting the efforts in it and doing it, like for me, you got to have some other source of entertainment there. The Rick Ross, Mr. Cool, Melanie Camacho, now, opinion, ding, 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 just my opinion, I wouldn't have did none of that. You would have done that? No. I wow. Here's why I wouldn't have done it. Okay. It would have been a bike event where the money that he paid, that, that, that the committee that they paid to get these people in to do that, I would have paid. Because here's what happens at black bike events. There's no vendors there. We got plenty of vendors. I know. No, 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 no. Not the African shirt sellers, not the food trucks. Not, I'm talking about Daytona. I'm just using this. But not the food trucks, not the T-shirt people, not the, uh, but I would have brought in Corbin, Sal. Performance machines. PM. We're going to get to them. No, 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 no. I know, I know, I know, yeah, I know. No, but, but our goal was, first off, our goal was to establish the event. Hey man. So that now I have something hey. to present to them. Oh. Hey man. He just what? said what he was. I got hey man. Can I can I, I can I, go ahead. Can go ahead. I get my <laughs> But I get what you Yeah. Said. My 30 right. seconds. Go ahead. Just do my that. 30 seconds. Okay. So, with the what they had to do to get the entertainment that they got, mm -hmm. right? Think about this, right? Had you had niggas and lights, you could have got uh custom dynamics. They say, "Hey, I'll pay you to come to my event." I'll give you five thousand a day. It's fifteen grand. Sell all you want to, this one time. But when you come back, you, you got to pay me if this works, okay? Which we know it's gonna work because you niggas want lights all over everything. You want to ride around on a Christmas tree. Uh, guy, you walked up on some damn lights. Walked up. <laughs> you might get your bike. You want lights, but after you get it, then yeah. Yeah, that's after right, you get that's, it. That's but think about the community that. Think about the bikers, the, the bike thousands of people that follow. I understand what you're saying, like, like you said, D and D pipe, thunderheaders. No, I wouldn't have did none of that uh, stuff. Man, I would have brought in people. Man, it's like well, a freak yeah. mentality. What, what they, what they, what they do? They get, they give you some free crap. Yeah. And then they get you to come back and get the crap. Well, you and then bam, when you come and back, boom, Arlen Ness, why not D and D? That's all. Because almost. you can't tune a bike there. You got to remember, it's three days. I can do lights. You can do audio. You could do, you could do accessories, mirrors, floorboards. You got the, the, um, the thing that you used to tune it up with. What thing? Wasn't there the, the pack, the little electric trying to thing that you that you used to, to tune your okay. bike? Oh, you talking about the tune store, audio tune? Yeah. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, audio. Whatever it's called. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm, when you say D and D pipe, D and D exhaust. He was talking about like uh, uh, uh Like let's just say if you wanted Dino to get your jet. bike tuned, uh, uh, Dino Jet, TTS, Techno Research. All these people, well, you have to put it on a dyno to dyno. Oh, okay. You ain't got time for that. Yeah, they ain't nothing. But think about it. You can let Clockwork, Kerry Arkin, pull up with one of their big trailers. <laughs> Harley, pull up with their big trailers and say, hey, bring all of this Empire stuff. Bring all of the stuff that you can. But then again, you know, you have to sort of kind of let people see what you're doing so they can say, shit, we might need to get on with that. So, but think about this, right? The money that he paid, that they paid to get the entertainment out there, that they were, took the hundred mm -hmm. or whatever, or whatever they had to pay, it gave, shit, gave me, gave me 2500 It's like, hey, come down here, we're going to do this. Or let's just use some name brands. I'm a brand. We're a brand, okay? But I'm going to support him in whatever it is that he do. But think about this. You get carried, like, clock, cycle, custom dynamics. They make all the LED turn signals. And, just like it's, and, just and, like it, um, and all of the stuff that what well, he got on his bike, right? Mm -hmm. 
Think about this. You get Carry Arc and Custom Dynamics to come down and do install. I'm going to give y'all for a weekend 10 grand. Get KST handlebars to come down because everybody wants these bars, but realistically, when you traveling, man, you probably got a you probably got a thousand dollars to mess up for the weekend. Mm -hmm. You can't do no handlebars where these boys are doing 30 to 45 bikes a day and they charge you they charge you seven hundred fifty dollars that's bars and installation mm -hmm. how quick do you have a 750 so stay with me so you got a handlebar guy there you got some light people there you got audio people there oh man they got man they got real they got real bike vendors here now we tried it i tried to get a guy there to do handlebars i tried to get a guy there to do light they or not do all change do all services like right now do you have a servicer there no no no, no, no think no, no. about the people that's going to ride their motorcycles change. down there car wash we got the bike washer certified and all that you yeah, ain't got to have no certified heart attack yeah, but think about it the dream plug. I know what it is. I but think it about it though if you got a guy that's just going to service bikes but built to do rallies built to do rallies because if they ain't built to do it they gonna go crazy so you're gonna charge harley charges 85 to 125. An hour. No, for oil change. Okay. Oil. How much you pay for a case of oil, bro? Right. Okay, we're going to put the bids out. But you can buy a case of oil, some filters, and go down there and charge $100 a bike. With a case, you just, uh, whatever. Well, There's a profitable it. margin in it for you to make money. You make about $25, $30 every time you just we're gonna let you I'm gonna let you keep that number that long. Fuck that. The money ain't gonna be the same. We need to stay where these white folks at. I said, man, we got I got a feeling this going this gonna blow up. Yeah, I said it, hot damn it. I ain't scared. So you know what we're doing. He said y'all well, we in Daytona. He did Daytona. he didn't Daytona. want to go over there. Well, we they wanted up, to stay at JMP Cycle. Okay. But JMP Cycles didn't want us over there because we did not offer a product to sell mm. in their store. So they was like, nah. Battistini was willing to make a speaker grill for us so that we could set up and sell the speaker grill out of there and set up to do the audio at, in front of JMP Cycles where yeah. we used to do it. At. Well, didn't work out. I was like, Dede, man, we got to go to Bethune. I think it's gonna work. They was like, nigga, fuck that. We need to figure out a way how to stay over here. Let me tell you something. Best move we ever made. Yeah, I would have told you that. But but it'd be caught. And then another thing is we had over there, you closed down. Over over at Bethune. Because what would happen was we would work there and then we would go to the uh, house. And then and keep, still keep working. working. So everybody that we did Cause they catch, kicking you out of, yeah, they kicking you out of JMP cycles at six o'clock. Mm. You better pack that shit up. So when, when, basically when, when you go on one of these bike events, go vacation, you ain't never on vacation. No, I don't go on you vacation. Work. We go to work. We do vacation. When I go on vacation. When you go on vacation, you take your wife to an island somewhere with no more. I don't want to hear no motorcycle. Yo. So funny story. We in Panama City this past weekend. This Thunder Beach weekend. Oh, this Thunder it? Beach week okay. right now. Thursday, guy saw me. Hey, where y'all set up at? I've been following you and that guy, uh, uh, <laughs> you know, HNI, uh, Big Sale. I was like, oh man, I'm, I'm down here with my family. I'm just, I'm just kidding. Man, well, I know where y'all gonna, where y'all gonna really be set up at? I said, bro, I'm not down here chilling. Yeah. Damn, man, I wanted to get my audio done while I was down here. I was gonna be looking for y'all because I got this JM audio stuff in here and this shit, I got to get rid of all of this. I was like, 800 Blueberry Lane, Ellenwood, Georgia, buddy. You, you a hot 300 from me. Pull up. I told him to ride up. We get your audio in. You can go back. Mm. Where are you from? That was in Panama City. Unfortunately, I got to ride a motorcycle 791 miles to Dallas, Texas. <laughs> I love no, that. fortunately, I'm I going to meet with my club brothers all over the country. We're going to meet in one place. 
I'm coming too, in my Harley too. I'm gonna be on my Harley. <laughs> <laughs> I'm be on my Harley. Yeah. So this will be Eleanor's first trip out. My CVO. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, how good this feels. Let me look over here at these niggas in that. Hey, man. Ready to change all the fluid. I am fully serviced anyway, and highway uh, ready. That's what it is, man. We've been over here chilling, man. We're going to let Chris get back to work. Hope you guys enjoyed this segment. And it's just us shooting the shit, man. Chris gave you guys some jewels and dropped some jewels. But Tampa Jamboree, make sure that you guys come on out, man. Have a good time. Where well, I'm going to be at now? Chris will be set up right across from the restrooms. He has the whole... You won't be able to miss him. Yeah. Come in the right. gate. Come yeah. in the gate. We go right in the way. No. It's, we got restrooms, not toilets. Yeah. They have restrooms and showers and everything. All that. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. right right across you right across from the VIP area. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 that yeah, part yeah, right yeah, there. Yeah, right yeah. across from the VIP. So y'all come on out, man. Tampa Jamboree. Chris Can't wait. Doing full set. So listen, if they need to get with you to set up an hey, another chain. 448-95-0744, all social media platforms. Except for I'm on all of them, so just hit us so up. So you can set up call them right now and set up your appointment to have your music done right in Tampa. There. Right yeah. now. They got three spots left, you said, right? Three spots. So there we go. That's it. What? Phone ring. <laughs> Wait a minute. What phone? <laughs> All right, y'all. We go. Be. <laughs>